a few targets and uh, a Best Buys, and I actually um I got these things out of it in the a MacBook charger for the MacBook um which uh, some it did something to it. I'll do that in a later video, but yeah. So I guess I'll just go from least to greatest. Uh, I guess the least is this iPod Touch second gen. This one has a weird power button. It does work. It's just it doesn't really click right, and sometimes it's weird. I don't know. It has good battery. Uh, it's on an iOS. I haven't even checked this yet. Wait. Or iPhone OS. I don't know. Whatever. iPhone OS 4.2.1. I think it only wanted to... Oh, no. I, it was I called iPhone OS and I, iOS 3 and things like that. But, yeah. It has a bunch of old games on it. I'm not going to reset it because it's cool games that you can't really download anymore. It's perfect condition, pretty much, besides the back. Uh, I don't... There's no major cracks on the screen. Or no cracks at all. And then there's... It's a 16 gigabyte model. All my other models were 8 gigabytes, so that's cool. So, yeah. And my others are down here. I have tons, and then there's more that are broken that are in a parts bin, but... Well, with bad digitizers, I mean. Um, next was this. Um, I got this one today. This is the only find I got today. This is an iPod Touch uh, third gen, uh, sixty or I mean, uh, thirty-two gigabytes. It's the only thing that was in the bin, and this one works. It has a Google image thing of a horse as a lock screen. It has a passcode. I can bypass. It. I just need to reset it in iTunes. I just haven't done it yet. Uh, but yeah, it works fine. I've been charging it. I guess the charge is kind of slow, I guess. Or maybe it has a bad battery. I'm not quite sure. But this one's in decent condition. It has a small crack. And I posted this one on my Instagram. I posted actually all of these besides this one. Oh, no, I did post this one. Yeah, never mind. Um, next is this iPod Touch 4th Gen. Now, before you look at the back, here's the front. It has a bad battery. It doesn't last very long. Uh, let me just turn down the brightness real fast. But yeah, uh, this and the other iPod that's, um, or the first iPod that I showed you guys, iPod Touch 2nd Gen. Um, that's 16 gigabytes. These were the, both in the bin. It was literally empty besides these two. There's not even like an ink cartridge. It was just empty. But yeah, this thing looks like it's on iOS 4. It's actually or, uh, it's actually on uh, iOS 6.0.1. They just didn't update the wallpaper. But yeah, and this one, there's two cool things about it. First of all, the back is mint condition. Look at this. It has a protector on it, and it's had on ever since you know it got it because you could see through the protector. And I'll uncover the gigabyte uh, thing soon, which I'll do right now, actually. 32 gigabytes, so that's really sick. I actually have another 32 gigabyte iPod Touch, 4th uh, gen, but it's cracked. This is the other one. And it has a really bad condition back, but I got this one for $10 on Mercari, I'm pretty sure. But yeah, that's just this one. It's my other one, so it's better to have this one now, or the mint one. Too bad it has a weird battery. Let me just take this off. Okay, yeah, so the other one does work fine. Um... Yeah, but it's really scratched. Uh, it is 32 gigabytes, but yeah, I don't think this has a charge either. I might plug it in later. Um, no, it doesn't. See, so yeah, I'm just going to put that back there. Um, so yeah, this is mint condition, 32 gigabytes, and probably it's on iOS 4 or 5. I don't know, whatever it, whatever um, this one was actually purchased on. But yeah, works fine. Besides the battery, it doesn't last very long. In fact, it was fully charged like 20 minutes ago, and I haven't been using it. So yeah. Next is this LG K3. I'm pretty sure it's a K3. I'm not quite sure what the actual thing is, but it works. Had no passcode and it was literally like had a Samsung case on it, like for a cheaper Samsung budget phone that they like cut to put on it. It's like a weird leather case. I don't know. Um, is that ads? You. And you can't even get, wow. Thank you, Boost Mobile. Um, yeah, I guess I'll, oh, it isn't it? It's an LG K3. I was right. Okay. Um, it's perfect condition. It was really dirty on the back, and the water damage stickers just aren't there. I don't know if this thing was water damage, and it was just taken off, or maybe someone took it off for some unknown reason. I'm not quite sure. Probably owned by an older person, because it's a cheap phone and a or budget phone. It didn't even have the right case on. But, yeah, it works fine. It didn't even need to Google lock or bypass this one. What is it downloading? Oh my gosh, that thing's down. I, I, I didn't download anything onto this. I didn't even attach any of my accounts. I can even prove that, actually. Um, yeah, it's just randomly downloading things. I'm gonna have to get rid of all the bloat. Let's see. Yeah, I had no passcode, so I just reset it. Uh, it had a Google account, so I deleted it and put on my Google account just to make sure it wouldn't be Google locked. But, yeah, perfect condition. So everything I got was in pretty good condition, I guess, besides the cracked one, which is this one. So, yeah. Um, now I finally, um, I, and if I didn't have these two, all of my iPod Touch second and third gens would have been 8 gigabyte for some reason, but now... These, I have better ones, so yeah. Looks like one of these has an aftermarket screen, actually, if you can tell the difference on the lock screen. I'm not quite sure which one. Oh, it's probably this one, because this one looks really weird. I don't know, but yeah. So that's really all I got. 
and I'll do an update video on the MacBook soon. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.